Intermountain Healthcare is a integrated delivery system in Utah. We have uh, 23 hospitals, um, 1,400 uh, employed physicians, 27 retail pharmacies, a health plan, and um, a central distribution system, and home care and several other services. And we um, serve the people of the Intermountain West. Uh, we try to help people live their the healthiest life possible. And our motto is healing for life. And we try to provide services to people. We provide services to people regardless of their ability to pay. Using 340B Savings, we do several different kinds of programs. We have a voucher program for, for diabetes. We do some voucher things for um, anticoagulation clinic. We have patients that um, are in some of our clinics that um, don't have the ability to pay and we do voucher kinds of things for them uh, based on their uh, inability to, to provide their prescriptions. We have a program we call MedReady, which is um, in-room delivery for prescription meds. One of the other things we do is we provide chemotherapy services at small rural hospitals so that patients, when they go up to the cancer centers in Salt Lake, they can go back to their home and we can provide that um, chemotherapy service uh, at their, the hospital closest to them. And we fund that and we provide the medications because those small hospitals have a hard time um, affording the, the clean rooms and things that are required for that. And so we use our home care to provide those services and deliver the medications to the rural hospitals so that patients don't have to go back to the cancer center to get their treatment. An example of a patient that was helped by 340B was a 52-year-old diabetic that um, had been admitted to the hospital 32 times in 14 months um, because her diabetes was not in, in control. And we were able to put her on our um, voucher program and prov help provide her insulin for her. She still had to pay a copay, but reduced the cost greatly to her. And um, in the three years since then, um, she's not been admitted again. If 340B was eliminated or um, significantly rolled back, that would um, have a major effect on our ability to provide services like chemotherapy in rural hospitals and diabetes um, voucher programs and other kinds of prescription services for the indigent. We, would just, we wouldn't have the money to do that. We already spend significant money um, on on um, charity care and there's a limited source of that. So this money is, is um, extremely valuable in providing those services.